This is the digital function generator coil. This one is the constant coil. Okay, this is one of the coil which is number one connected to a capacitor 0 0.7 microfarad which is parallel connection with the oscilloscope. Before starting the experiment, let us set the oscilloscope to our favorable scale. First, let's set up the time per division by using this knob and change the time uh, until you set it is as 1 millisecond per division. Okay, next, we set up the volt per division by using this knob to 200 millivolt per division. Set up the digital function generator. First, let us set up the frequency to 500 hertz. So you push the frequency button and using this knob, just turn it until you get uh, 500 hertz. And then press OK. Next, set up the amplitude to 2 volt. And press OK. Last one is to set up the signal, the type of signal, which is a square wave. This symbol, which is the square wave, and then press OK. Next, for this experiment, we will be using four different solenoids. So we have to label this as solenoid 1, 1, 2, 3, and 4. For this one, you can refer uh, table 4.1 in your lab manual. Okay, so refer to number of coil based on the number of turns, radius, and length. The primary coil with our tested coil. Next, slowly, you push the coil to the primary coil until you get a wave. The wave should look something like this. Okay, since it's still moving, actually we can stop the run and push this button. Okay, and then we go back to our frame of oscilloscope and try to look at the wave closely. Okay, adjust the knob. Uh, the time knob to see if you can measure the distance between one peak to another peak of the damping wave. Okay, let's see if we can find the best damping wave among all these waves okay use the horizontal position knob and go through each wave okay this wave is quite okay so i will pick this one okay so i will zoom in a bit by adjusting the voltage knob and the time no okay and adjusting again using the horizontal knob okay and the vertical position knob to make it easier to measure between peak to peak 
as you can see the distance between these two peaks is actually it's about 0.6 division so the by calculating using multiplication of division to our set scale you will get 0.6 division times 200 millisecond which is equal to 120 microsecond so this is the period of the damping Next, we repeat the experiment by changing the coil to another one. So just take this out. And choose the second coil, this one. And connect it like this. And then repeat the step like the first coil. That's all. <laughs> 